Pisces, how are you doing? Let's see how you're feeling in love. Hold on one second. I have to relight my sage. Come on, why do I keep going out? Hope all is well with you guys. Um, just a few things. If you need to request a personal reading, you know, you can do so at Miss Hawaii. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Well, whatever. Miss Hawaii readings at gmail.com. I have opened them back up. I'll be doing them for the next month. I just asked for just 24 to 48 hours for me to get back to you with the reading. Um, just because it gives me time to meditate on your energies, you know what I mean? Also, if the videos ever resonate with you, don't forget to leave me a comment and let me know how they resonate. And also, don't forget to like the video and don't forget to subscribe and tell a friend. All right, Pisces, let's see what's going on with you. Oh my God, these cards are shuffling. Come on, cards. I think that's my hands hurting. <laughs> Can't blame the cards. I think it's me. Pisces. Let's see. How are my Pisces people feeling in love right now? How are my Pisces people feeling in love right now? Oh, King of Cups in reverse. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Um, y'all are cutting off y'all love for some reason. If that's not you, I'm seeing somebody here holding back their love from you. Somebody's not telling you how they truly feel. Somebody could be emotionally manipulative. You're not happy right now. You're not happy with your love life right now. That's the nine of cups in reverse. So you wish for something, you don't feel like you're getting your wish at the moment. More Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy. The world. There's a cycle here that you had to close out. Something here that you had to close out. Now you're going to start something new. Are you willing to start something new? Do you want to? Three of Swords in reverse. You're healing from a heartbreak. Five of Wands. Could have been some type of conflict. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. The Three of Swords in reverse shows me that you want forgiveness or you want to be forgiven. But you're healing from a heartbreak. You possibly want a reconciliation with somebody. That's Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy right there. The death card in reverse. You're resisting an ending. That's Scorpio energy right there. You're resisting an ending for some reason. Okay, that's the death card with the chariot in reverse. Knight of Wands in reverse. Somebody could have been in and out, non-committal. Okay, but I'm seeing you resisting an ending. Could be possibly with this King of Cups, somebody that's not being very nice to you, could possibly not be talking to you at the moment. Um, and it's something that you're not letting die. Chariot could be a cancer you're dealing with, no movement. Um, seeing a Knight of Cups here. You could have tried to make an offer to somebody carry in reverse you don't know which way to go you're very confused with your direction at the moment and your happiness too oh ace of cups finally something good new love seeing love you love this person or this could be new love coming in i have to clarify some more cancer, feisty, scorpion energy, the hangman. You feel stuck, ten of swords in reverse. You don't want something to dive with somebody. I feel like 
there was some type of brutal ending, but you're not, now you're healing from it. You know what I mean? But I feel like you kind of want to revive this with the Ten of Swords in reverse. I feel like you're not letting go of somebody. Okay, the chariot. I feel like you love this person. The magician in reverse. Somebody was manipulative. Queen of Cups, didn't I just say it? You love this person. Page of Pentacles, you want to have a conversation. Four of Swords in reverse. You want to come out of this, whatever this is between you and this person. Um, I see them as King of Cups in reverse. Emotionally manipulative, like I said, could not be talking to you. This person could love you, but just not be expressing that to you. Show me this King of Cups in reverse. That popped out. The Emperor. Some of y'all could be dealing with an Aries. Mm, that's major arcana right there. That's somebody, this could be somebody that's very um, successful. Somebody that's like a business person. It could be somebody that's a father, father figure. This is somebody that's mature. The queen of wands. Okay, who is that? That I think that's your energy towards them. You love that person. Or well, they see you as the queen of wands. You want a new beginning with them. Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Show me this Nine of Cups in Reverse. Your cards are like popping out. You're waiting on this person. Seven of Pentacles, some of y'all. You're trying to decide. I feel like you feel like... I feel like you put in perse perseverance towards this person. Like, you're not giving up. Ace of Swords, you want truth. You want to talk to this person. That's Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Show me the Three of Swords in reverse. Seven of Wands in reverse. Now that you're healed, you're not as guarded. You're ready to take the next step. Show me the Death in reverse. Queen of Cups in reverse. There's somebody here that you... Queen of Cups. This could be you. This could be your energy, I'm thinking. Pisces. You don't want it. You're resisting this ending. And it's driving you crazy. Queen of Cups in reverse. You're emotionally unstable. So you're weak about this. You're sad. You're depressed. You don't want this to end. Show me the chariot. Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, you're not um you're not taking any moves right now as far as your what you want, as far as your home, your love life. Like, I feel like that's on hold right now. But you know what you ultimately want. Like you want this Ten of Pentacles with this person. And that's what got you confused though. You don't know which direction to take. You don't know how to get that with this person. The three of wands. Here you are. That's you waiting for your ships to come in. I feel like a part of you is waiting on this person, like for a new beginning with this person. Show me the hangman in reverse. I feel like you're waiting on them. You don't want this cycle to be over. Ten of wands in reverse. You do not want this cycle to be over. The magician in reverse again. Somebody was manipulative. You want success in this. You're very unhappy with your home life right now. Inactive. Trying to decide. I feel like you'd be fantasizing about this person too, Pisces. Thinking about them a lot. I'm seeing Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, heavy. I see Aries, Leo, Sagittarius as well. And of course, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Now let's see how your person is feeling. Hell did I put the cards over here in front of my face? Dun. All right, 
how is your person feeling, Pisces? What's going on in your love life, Pisces? Let's see. Show me who's thinking about Pisces. Show me who's thinking about Pisces. Show me how the person that Pisces is thinking about, how they're feeling about them. Thank you, Spirit, for the clear message. Thank you, angels, for guidance, proper guidance. How's your person feeling? Ooh, I got two cards that came out. I'm going to take them both. The Hierophant in Reverse and the Five of Cups. This person is feeling regret, sadness, depressed about this. The Hierophant in Reverse. There's a breakup here. Three of Cups could have been because of a third party. That's a Taurus energy right there with the Hierophant. And I'm seeing Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Ooh. Could be dealing with a Leo. This person, you make this person happy. Knight of Cups in reverse. Somebody was a heartbreaker or somebody's heartbroken. Somebody could have made an offer that was rejected. The Sun card is a Leo. Um, I feel like you make this person really, really happy. There's that Knight of Cups again in reverse with the Eight of Swords on the bottom. I feel like somebody here is in and out. Or this could be your energy where they see you as the three of cups. There's a three of cups again. This person wants to reunite with you. Three of swords on the bottom of the deck in reverse. This is about reconciliation getting over pain, getting over heartbreak. Let me go ahead and map out the rest of these cards. The lovers, ooh, Gemini energy. Two of swords, Can't, this is about a decision. This person's trying to decide what to do. Decision in love. They feel a deep, passionate connection with you. The Emperor in reverse. You could definitely be dealing with an Aries. There's that Emperor again. The Ace of Cups in reverse. I feel like this person is not telling you how they truly feel. This person is not being honest with their feelings. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, but that Knight of Cups card, that is Pisces. And it's reverse. So I feel like they see you as emotionally unstable a bit. The Knight of Swords. Some of y'all dealing with, ooh, Five of Pentacles. Some of y'all dealing with Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Hmm. So somebody feels like, this person feels like you're cutting them off. Five of Pentacles. Knight of Swords, some change is going to happen in this relationship. But the Knight of Swords takes action. So I feel like this person wants to come in and take some type of action towards this. Show me the higher font. Show me the higher font. judgment card wow so whatever this breakup was between you that's two major arcana whatever this breakup was between you and this person they feel like they're being judged they feel like they feel like it's their fault they, they're willing to yep didn't i just say it seven of swords some type of deception here some type of deception, some type of cheating or lying, some type of sneakiness. Um, this person feels bad about it With on top of the Five of Cups. They feel depressed, sad. Show me the Sun card. What 
is that? The Knight of Wands in reverse. This person is non-committal, afraid of commitment. Some of y'all. With the Knight of Wands in reverse, this person is really in and out. Could be like an erratic relationship. Show me this Knight of Cups in reverse. That's Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, that Knight of Wands. The Three of Pentacles in reverse. You're not coming together with this person. You're, um, they're holding on to you, though, with the Four of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but they're just not coming together with you. Show me the Three of Cups. They could have rejected your offer in the past. Maybe you made an offer. I feel like this person has broke your heart, though. Some of y'all work with this person. King of Swords in reverse. Ooh, on top of the Three of Cups. Huh. Two scenarios here. Um, either this person wants to come together with you and they're not telling you with the King of Swords in reverse. Um... No, that's what I'm getting. I feel like this person wants to come together with you and they're not telling you. Okay. You could also be dealing with an Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini. If so, this person can be a little bit cold, manipulative, but this person is not speaking to you. The Fool. This person wants a new beginning with you. The Knight of Cups. There you go. Again, upright. Romantic offer. This person wants a new beginning with you. They want to take a leap of faith. On top of the lover's card, show me the emperor in reverse. Show me the emperor in reverse. Ooh, ten of swords in reverse. Didn't you get that card? On top of the emperor. I feel like this person is still healing from whatever happened between y'all. Five of cups again, but in reverse. So they want to reconcile with you for sure. They want peace and harmony in this. They are taking the blame for whatever happened. They do feel guilty about it. Um, some type of deception here, sneakiness, okay? With the emperor in reverse, I feel like this person could have been controlling. You could be dealing with an Aries, but I feel like if not, this person just is really not taking that much action. Um, but I feel like they are healing right now with the Ten of Swords in reverse. They're healing from whatever happened between you guys. Some type of betrayal, a brutal ending. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. And right now they're healing from that. But I feel like they do want to kind of bring this back to life. Revive what was dead here. Show me the Knight of Swords, please. Show me the Knight of Swords. Show me the Knight of Swords. All these cards fell out. The Emperor fell out. Death card and the Seven of Wands fell out. Wow. Show me the Knight of Swords, please. Show me the Knight of Swords. King of Wands in reverse flipped over. Let me see. I want to pick the card. Ten of Wands. Yeah, they. I feel like this person, they're having a hard time believing. So listen, this could be somebody else. If this is not the same person, right? This could be two different people for some of you. I'm seeing a Knight of Swords and I'm seeing a Knight of Cups. So if, if it's two different people, I see a Knight of Swords, okay? Somebody that's a bit stressed out, okay, over this connection, but I feel like they're going to take action and come towards you. They kind of want to complete a cycle with you. You make, they, you make them happy. They're just feeling like they're not believing in this between you and them. They're not sure, okay? Then I'm also seeing, that, or it could be if it's the same person, the same energy, there was some beef, like I said, in the past between you and somebody. And this person wanted a new beginning with you. With the Fool and the Lover's card, two major arcana next to the Emperor. And then the Ten of Swords in reverse. They definitely want a new beginning with you. Um, there was some type of deception here. Um, person feels bad about it. Okay. I'm seeing somebody that was afraid of commitment. Let's see what's the mutual energy. What's the mutual energy here between Pisces and the person that they're thinking about? 
What is the mutual energy between Pisces and the person that you're thinking about? Three of Cups. Y'all both want to come together. You both want to reunite. Both want to party together, celebrate, have a couple drinks, talk about this. Knight of Swords in reverse. Okay, there's a Knight of Swords again in reverse. Y'all both want change in this, but nobody's taking action. Nobody's taking action and it's driving both of y'all fucking crazy. Y'all both want to talk. Ace of Swords. Truth. Victory. Y'all both want victory in this. Y'all want to have a discussion about this. Can I just say it? Seven of Cups. I feel like you both fantasize about each other a lot. Think about this. Maybe this reunion a lot. Or just, just your times together. The Eight. Okay, that's the Strength card in reverse. So I feel like a lot of y'all don't really know feel like both of you guys are having trouble like inner strength dealing with this both not sure which direction to go queen of pentacles in reverse you're both not nurturing this relationship putting much into this right now the king of cups you both love each other though both love each other deeply and you both want to have a conversation with the page of pentacles both want to talk. This is important face-to-face -face conversations. Um, but you both love each other deeply. Okay. You both may not be expressing that at the moment. Okay. I'm seeing uh Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo, um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay. And um, that's your reading, Pisces. If it resonated, don't forget to let me know how it did, and I'll see you next time. Toodles.